All right, walk us through those first five minutes as a team and then uh, talk about overtime and eventually the game winner. Yeah, I mean, uh, early in the game, I thought we came out really fast. Uh, we're all over them. Um, got a couple chances early. Rich, Rich played a great ball, put me in, and I just had to be in the right place to, to put it away. So that was nice. Um, I thought as the game went on, we kind of took our foot off the pedal. Had a 2-0 had a lead and, and maybe didn't, didn't go, after, uh, go after the throat uh, like we should have. But um, credit, to, credit to them for fighting back. Um, and then in overtime, it's, it's just about grinding it out and, and getting in positions to win the game. And I thought we did that. Uh, really just keep playing our game. Uh, keep our heads down, keep attacking, and, and don't get exposed on the counter. Um, they're a good counter-attacking team, so we had to, even when attacking, be aware of that. Um, and I thought we fought, fought really hard. Coming off of a tie against Penn State Friday, you guys knew that this was going to be a tough game for you guys, but what was kind of the biggest area that you wanted to see? Yeah, I mean, absolutely. Whenever you go to like overtime the couple days before, it is, it is a little tough on the legs. Um, but we really just wanted to come together as a unit and continue to play our game. Um, I felt like we didn't play as quick as we would have liked against Penn State. And uh, today, was, today was a little bit better, but there's still some things to improve on. But it, it's still early, so we're, we're confident. What are some of the, those improvements that you just mentioned, not only for yourself, but for the rest of the team that you hope you guys can work on for the rest of the season? Um, I would say really just patience on the ball. Um, so we, we typically have a lot of the ball, and we know we're going to. Uh, so teams, teams will pack it in on us and just being patient, moving the ball around, but also moving it, like I said, with a, with a pace, with a speed of play that, that helps us to open up opportunities to create chances. And the first half possession was kind of really big for you guys. How big was possession in the rest of the game? Uh, it's always nice to have the ball. Uh, the more you have the ball, the less you have to defend. So we, we like that, um, but we know that sometimes we're not going to have the ball the whole time and we've got gotta to come together as a unit and defend, and I, I thought we did that well enough tonight. You guys kind of have a little bit of a break before you play Friday. So what's kind of the recovery process? Yeah, tomorrow um, we'll probably be recovering pretty hard in the pool or, or foam rolling. Um, and then the rest of the week it's just getting healthy, getting guys confident again and, and ready to go uh, go Friday. How would you describe the team's bond? I saw, saw a little bit of like a victory dance after the first two shots. <laughs> Do you know anything about that? Um, I don't know about the victory dance, but I, I know the team's really close. Um, it's probably the closest we've ever been. Did a good job in preseason uh, getting to know, know one another and really uh, connect. And uh, I feel like that's going to be a big part uh, later down the season especially. Awesome. Thank you. Awesome. Thank you. Okay. Awesome. Thank you. It was nice Appreciate to meet you. It.